Hi, my name is Alex. I'm a product designer here at Rebella. I'm excited to give you a look at some new features designed to streamline your workflow on the platform. In this video, I'll walk you through our new toolbar designed to make your experience of creative measurements, shapes, and points much easier and faster. First, let's take a look at the new toolbar. Previously, you had to click on the measure top and then create a measurement. A new window would then open with all the available tools and templates. We have now streamlined this process, so you will find all this in some brand new toolbar located at the top left of your map window, so it's now easier to find and start a measurement. Let's have a closer look at the toolbar. The toolbar features three permanent buttons for basic shapes. Point, line and polygon. These are what we designers call dual action buttons. Put simply, you can do two things. When you click on the icon, this will activate the basic drawing tool. And when you click on the drop down, this shows you all the available templates for that particular shape type. Let me show you. If I click on the point icon to create a point of interest, this activates a basic point tool for location data and a description field. And when I click on the drop down, I can now see other point templates. When I click on the line icon, this activates a basic line tool for lens data. In the drop down, I can easily see and select different measurements like distance or cross section. Finally, when I click on polygon, this activates a basic polygon tool for surface area. And in the dropdown, I can easily see and select other polygons, like cut fill or stockpile. And if I click on the circle information icon next to any of the templates, it will show you an explanation of the template. You can also see pin icons next to each template. These are bookmarks. To bookmark a template, click the pin icon and it will be added next to the toolbar for a quick access. To unpin the template, click the unpin icon in the dropdown. You can bookmark up to 9 templates allowing you to basically customize the toolbar. And if you need more flexibility, you can still create custom templates by selecting custom points, line or polygon from the dropdown menu. Then select the measurements and custom items you want to display from the list. The toolbar buttons also has built-in hotkeys, which allow for super quick tool selection. You can view the keys by hovering the mouse cursor over the button until the tooltip appears. The hotkeys for point, line and polygon are P, L and O respectively. And for your bookmarked templates, this will be the numeric keys 1 to 9 from left to right. You've probably noticed in this video that all measurement properties are shown on the right. Previously, this data was displayed on the left, which could be a little cumbersome as it would cover your list of items. With our new design, the properties panel is now located on the right of your screen and shows the measurements in detail while keeping your map in view. Plus, it's collapsible if you need more map space. That's it. We hope you enjoyed this introduction to the new toolbar. We think it will make many of your workflows a lot easier in the platform. If you want to find out more, check out the details in the description below. Thanks for watching.